What was the last one? APS now. Oh, no, it's on now. Instruments. I'm indicating 320 and uh, 3004. Count meter. 3004. It's uh, standby and a close it. The icers. Hold on. Hydraulic pressure. You up to now? Round and boom. To the left. Okay, we're going to on the left here. Okay, we're going to on the left here. Okay, we're going to on the left here. Okay, we're going to on the Captain, the right thing. On the left. Okay. Ground over, it's 462, uniform, ready, taxi, depart. Average 462, Anchorage, ground, taxi, runway 32 at Kilo, view Romeo. Romeo to 32 at Kilo, over, it's 462. 32 Kilo, via Romeo. Thank you, please, triple five. Thank you, Thanks. All right, you want to do two crew break. It's going to be the uh, 95, um, we're right at 50,000, and um, we'll board before 95 afterwards in flight. We'll come around for the parallels if we have to. Otherwise, 4,000, left turn 300, I've got uh, 300 in the bug. And uh, any questions? Vacuum. Check left. On the right, and friends. What was it? Hey, Instruments. Ground, uh, I'm indicating uh, 150. Uh, green air 217, Romeo 10. Uh, Correct. Uh, sorry. The advisor starting engines. Harvey. Uh, it's cold. Wait. Start. Wait. Start. I'm indicating 3 2 3 set. Go selector. Oh, uh, me and Zoria, friends. Uh, power for the warning. It's on. Superchargers. No. Oh. Controls. Alright. Correct. And holds. Alrighty. Average 462, Anchorage Tower, company will pass by new runway 32, kilo position hold. Position hold 32 at kilo, average 462. Kilo left and position hold, we can do the hold items. Extended on. Oxide rock pump. It's on. Those pumps. Front and high. Make sure. Bridge. It's on. Thunder. 
Yeah, Piper Average four sixty two six hundred for four thousand.
Well, this is the Everett's Flight 462 today, and we're headed to Anyak at the 12,000 feet here. It's a little hazy, but uh, clear otherwise we can see the Alaska range. And uh, it's going to be about an hour and 45 minute flight. We're about 25 minutes into it, and um, through airspeed, once we get to cruise, it's going to be about 170 knots. Um, indicated airspeed is going to be much less than that because of the high altitude. Um, and uh, we're consuming about uh, maybe 350 gallons on the way to Anyak. Uh, and, uh, well, it's uh, outside air temperature, by the way, is about zero degrees freezing, which is hot for Alaska at this altitude. And uh, really not much else going on right now. Stefan's doing the flying. And in a second here, we're going to transition into uh, cruise power and uh, go through the cruise checklist. On a hot day like this, our primary concern the climb is the uh, climb gradient for IFR and also the cylinder head temperatures they tend to creep above 200, which is quite warm. So we're happy to level off here at 12,000 and cool them off a little bit. We're also uh, in a uh, high blower configuration for the engines that uh, we can shift from a low speed to a high speed supercharger um, and, uh, and this once you climb to 10,000 or so especially in hot weather like this we need we need high blow and we use that we use these electrical switches they activate a, uh, a clutch a mechanical clutch in the, in the a supercharger section of the engine we'll probably keep it that way until we get the other side of the mountain to start descending Weather-wise, it's uh, pretty nice, and uh, Aniak is uh, overcast weather, not quite nearly as warm. But we have to traverse an area of scattered thunderstorms that we'll see in about a half hour or so. But hopefully, hopefully we'll find our way through there. Well, we are almost 10 degrees Celsius warmer than what's... We could technically be at 35 inches of manifold pressure. Right, need it. Say what? Almost need it. Yeah, I'll, I'll give it a little more here. Area 36 at zero point seven. Can you now jump on station? Maintain 2000. Station 2000, there. So just a 791 that refrigerator is Before you go, you do have VFR traffic at uh, 11 to 12 o'clock at about 15 miles northbound. That's unknown else to indicate 7,700. With approach briefing, we'll go to Ipsy. We'll go down to 9,000. So right now. After Ipsy, it's a left turn 244 degrees. Down to 3,500. Ten more minutes, you can monitor anchorage center on 125.55. Um, to Apwis, and then we'll make a right turn uh, on a course of 283 down to 1,700. 
Final approach makes us half through. After that, we good down to an altitude of 540 for the straight in. And if we had the circle for whatever reason, it would be a 5 For the missed approach, we'll be climbing left turn to 3500 back to Hapwis and hold at 3500. And we'll be landing on runway 28. The runway is uh, 6,000 feet long at an elevation of 88 feet. Let me look it up in the supplement, see if they give you a different identifier. You're going to Elmendorf, you said? Yeah, that guy is Ariel Curl. We have to get in there and put 94. Here's 794, thanks for the ETA. We are showing about... Uh, all right, and uh, many gear. Many gear. We've got six lights. Make sure she. Mitch. Props. Good for now. She breaks. I should not. Top flaps. Fail. Kirby. They are cold. Light flaps. As needed. On side rods, off. It's off. Meters. Uh, cut them on for now. Cut them off later. Okay. Any accurate traffic efforts? 462 or Epsi inbound on the GPS today. Okay, if I come out, guys. Yeah. Thanks.